Ah, my trusted henchman. Come in, come in. Please, indulge me in one simple question. Anything, Your Unholiness. You need only... Where are the fugitives I ordered you to arrest? In your own time? Why, uh, that's easy, sire. They're right where we left them. Locked in our maximum security cell, our prisoners! <laughs> I see. So, um, <laughs> tell me, you repellent larvae, how your prisoners managed to reverse the malevolation of Utopia? <gasps> Gee, that's a good question. How did they do that? Silence, fool! Oh, we'll, 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 we'll find him, sire, and, and bring him to you. It's as good as done. We'll leave no stone unturned. No rock unrolled. Uh, your malevolence, I beg you. <laughs> Give us this one chance to prove that we can do your evil bidding, that we are still worthy. Go then. But do not fail me again. Remember... Reanimating your miserable corpses wasn't easy. Squeezing the life back out of them would be. Yes, sir! Hello! 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 Congratulations! Your mission was an astounding, tremendous, cutified success! I've been receiving messages from all over Qtopia. Tales of the wonderful transformations taking place. Can you believe it? It really worked. <laughs> I now have the power to cutify anything. Anyone. Happy day. Happy day. Yes, it is. Surely is. I'm glad we were able to help Qtopia, King Hugh. But I am looking forward to getting home now. And I have every intention of sending you there just as soon as you finish your end of the bargain. Finish? But I thought, I mean, I, I have finished. The machine is up and running. Utopia is cute again. True. Yeah. Mm -hmm. True. But if I'm not mistaken, the deal was for you to cutify the world. Meaning, of course, the whole world, not just Qtopia. Whole world? You don't mean, you can't mean Zenithu. And the Malevolands, as we agreed. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I, I agreed to that? Well, yes. Oh, come now, Drew. Surely we share the same sweet dream. This is our golden opportunity to spread happiness throughout the world. But, Your Majesty, if malevolation is bad for Qtopians, then think how cutification will feel to everyone else. Oh, yeah. My face can only take about four minutes of smiling before it starts to hurt. <laughs> no, you're just talking silly. What could be bad about cutification? Uh, sorry, uh, Hugh, this just doesn't seem right. I think we better leave well enough alone. You don't seem to understand. I'm not asking you to do this. I'm ordering you as my loyal subjects. Now, wait a minute. Before you speak, think about it. Defy me, and you'll most likely be stuck here forever. Are you really willing to take that chance? Yes. Yes. <laughs> of course. I knew you'd see it my way. Yes, of course. Yes, yes, yes. What do you mean, yes? I mean, yes. I'm not going to help you carry out this ridiculous plan. Yes, of course he's not. I guess I'll just have to find another way home. Well, have it your way, Drew. The world will be cutified, and you'll be stuck here forever. Wrong! The world won't be cutified. Only Flux and I know how to fly the machine, and we, and these, are out of here. Stop. You aren't going anywhere. I command you. Stop! You! That's right. 
It's me, Fluffy Fluffy Bun Bun, everybody's favorite bunny. A bunny with a master plan. That is never good. The cutification of the world is only phase one. Even now, Bric-a-Brac is busy developing an ultimate creative device. One that will give me the power to create all the happy things I desire. <laughs> In short, I will be a god. <laughs> oh, don't worry about the other King Hugh. He's safely locked away, learning how to be truly happy, just like me. And someday he, too, will take his rightful place at my feet. Woohoo! Time to skedaddle. Guards! Guards! Seize these enemies of Cutopia. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, it's not the king! It's Fluffy Fluffy Bug Bug! Masquerading as Hugh! Me? A cross-dressing, throne-seizing rabbit? <laughs> Surely you can do better than that. He has the keys to the machine. Oh, get him. <laughs> it's time to make our guests cute. Nothing happened. Flux, okay. It didn't work. <laughs> Goodness me, Daru. You are absolutely right. <laughs> but the fugitive and his machine are probably nowhere near the castle. As you recall, Hugh and his minions are already cutified. Yeah, whose idea was it to come here anyway? Not mine. Ooh. Not mine. Well, it certainly wasn't mine. <laughs> yes, it... Quiet! We don't have time to argue. We must locate their hiding place. Yes. Let's go that away. <laughs> come on, Flux. Snap out of it. There's a one big chance to get out of here! Golly, Drew, I am perfectly happy right here, thanks. You go on ahead. This one must take more power. <laughs> what? Yes, your cuteness! <laughs> I'm the leader, and I say we go that way! <laughs> Don't I know you? It's him! Get him! <laughs> My plan worked! Hooray! You've caused enough trouble, fugitive. We're taking you straight to Nefarious! He can't have gotten far. Alert the others. Find him! that machine, can't you? Why, sure I can. <laughs> then do it. <laughs> Cutify. Oh, I don't know. Everything. Of course, kind sir. Sorry. Did I wake you? <laughs> it's you. I should have guessed. Nefarious Simons! <gasps> That's Count Nefarious to you, little man. Master of the Malevolands, bane of Cutopia, and soon supreme ruler of the world. So please, show a little respect. Oh. Oh. Well. 
Where am I? Why, one's dungeon, of course. I trust you find the accommodations to your liking. I do try so very hard to furnish my guests with all the creature discomforts they deserve. I have a reputation to consider, you understand. What do you want from me? Want? From you? Nothing. You've done quite enough already, Drew Blank. But tell me, did you honestly believe that you, you fetid sack of pus, could just waltz into my world, casually thwart my plans for global domination, and then just ride off into the sunset? Think again. No, 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 thanks! I, I already gave it the office! Lovely, isn't it? It contains a little cocktail of my own invention. I suppose in layman's terms, it could be described as a mutagen ink. I won't tax your feeble brain with the details. Suffice it to say that once the serum has worked its way through your body, it will transform the Drew Blank we all know and loathe into a tomb like everybody else. Powerless, vulnerable, and a prisoner in my world forever. You're not gonna shoot me full of that stuff! Oh, bravo! <laughs> For once, you're absolutely right. I'm not going to. I already have. <laughs> Sorry. I can't help but find it all rather amusing. <laughs> you. Oh, yes, I know. I can be such a terrible prick. I'll get out of here, the fire, so help me! Oh, my dear Monsieur Blanc. <laughs> I wouldn't count on it. Even if you manage to worm your way out of that reinforced cell, the castle is simply crawling with ferocious guards. I'm sure you'd just die if you bumped into them. <laughs> As for possible exit points from the castle, well, I guarantee you'd find the plummet to the surrounding waters below nothing short of breathtaking. So, unless I'm overlooking some small detail, such as a pair of retractable wings that sprout out of your back, I'd suggest you sit back and relax like a good boy and let the mutagen take its course. You while I destroy the cutifier. What? Just tell me where it is, and I'll leave you to your unpleasant transformation. Tell you where to find the machine? Ha! Now that is amusing. Is it? <laughs> then perhaps you'll tell me. What's the matter? Cat got your tongue? Oh, I'm good. Now, think, Mr. Black. Cutifier. Where is it? When the machine left King Hugh's castle, it was flying due west. I guess it's nearing the edge of Qtopia by now, and heading directly for us. And who is piloting the infernal contraption? My friend, Flux Wildly. How convenient. I can destroy the machine and the meddling Zanian, all in one fell swoop. An auspicious start to our partnership, Mr. Blanc. Welcome to the team. Thank you, Master. I will serve you well. Until I escape. Impudent fool! Misfortune. Quickly, gaze into the future. I must know. Can this wretched creature escape my castle? I see... Drew Blank remaining your captive forever. Yes. Unless... Unless what? He will remain your captive unless... A lifeless knight walks, a dead bird rises aflame, and I myself obey his commands. Impossible! These absurd things could never come to pass. Of course, my liege. Yes, of course. Nevertheless, I will take further precautions. 
Make no mistake. I will personally blow your friend out of the sky. And as for you, sleepyhead, your life will be an unspeakable atrocity as my obedient slave. Sweet dreams.